hi guys welcome back to the angular 7 video tutorial and in this video tutorial we are specifically learn about the angular interpolation so i'm going to show you what points we are going to cover in this video so first is the what is the interpolation then how we can use the variables inside the interpolation array objects how we can do the arithmetic operations and what we cannot do inside the interpolation all right so first question is what is the interpolation so uh, let's say you have an html file uh, you have a component inside the angler and in the uh, component.html you want to print some variable which is coming from the, uh, the ts file and if you uh, want to don't know uh, if you don't uh, know about the much more about the component then you can watch our previous video link is also given in the description box so now uh, so let's say you want to pass the variable which is kind of the title uh, and we want to print it inside the HTML format, uh, HTML file. Then we can use this one, okay? And this is the smallest example. So with that, we just cover the two one how we can use the variable in this, and now we can learn how we can use the uh, array inside. So let's say I have an uh, another object like item array, and here I have some points like names like Sam, Bruce and last one is Jim and I want to print something how can do this okay there is a two way one is you can uh, show one by one and another is you can if you want to show the all then you can use the for loop but for loop I will I'll tell you in the next video because for loop have uh, the uh, ng for loop is a separate and a very big topic to discuss that's why I'm not going to include it so let's say you want to uh, use the second element element then you can use simply like this item array and print one okay and let's check here then you got the bruce here nice uh third one is let's say uh, i want to print an uh, object then how can i do this so let's say i have an uh, item object and i have a name with the nilin then how can I, can I print this That's, then this is also simple so then you can simply write here uh, item object dot name and you get here million also nice uh, fine but why this is not showing here I'm just okay so uh, these are all here so if you want to check the array length then you how you can do that then you can simply do that with the item array dot length and you got the uh, there is some problem item array okay so we got the hair length here so now what we kind of do here so let's say I want to make a, a one more variable with the name of a and I want to assign some value a equal to 10 then it cannot be done inside the pollution okay so you will get the error here the assignment operator cannot be done here okay so first thing that we cannot done here is this okay second uh, thing is uh, let's say you want to print a window object this they are uh, cannot uh, print here so for example let's say I just want to show the URL then I have to use the window dot location dot href but it's not going to work here for that you will see that uh, you cannot read the location property here the reason being uh, if you want to use the uh, window object then we have to call it from the ts file so let's say I, I will going to make a URL file uh, variable name and I'm going to uh, assign a value from here URL equal to this and now let's check then you got the URL here okay so these are the basic thing that uh, uh, is done by the okay so uh, there is some more things that uh, arithmetic operation then how we can do this then they are still also easy so if you want to add then you can use 4 plus 1 it will uh, gonna print here easily and if you want to true and true then it's also going to print here 
okay so that's all about the interpolations basic so thanks guys thanks for watching this video if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe our channel please comment some suggestions thanks guys thanks for watching this video also